hey guys, somebody lied. Yeah, I'm sorry. I thought I was not going to make another video, but unfortunately there is, so I decided to make another one, so why not? For you guys. Just to catch up a little bit on K pop. Um Okay, so Hey guys, if you don't know me, I'm Amma Jane on Amma Jane TV. Um Okay, so this is another review, yet again, another one, on my girls' girls' day. I knew they were going to nail it. I was just waiting for a bit of sexiness, a bit of summertime. This is a lot better than last year. What's this called? It was a Darling. Darling was a good song. It was a good time of jam, but this one just goes... It was it was it was it was just escalate a little bit more than last year, so it was a lot better. Yuba's hair was on point. They were all on point. I mean, you have Sojin's hair, Sojin's hair, bleach blonde hair. You had um, Mina's kind of brunettish kind of hair. You had Kiemi, if I'm correct, correct. That's her name, the youngest one. Her hair's back being black and. Whoa, that took me back. Her hair, they just, I think they put a, like, like, weave on her hair. It kind of took me back when they first debuted with, um, Twinkle Twinkle. Oh my god. <laughs> her hair looked exactly the way she debuted. It's just like a throwback. It was a little bit of a throwback on her hair. It looks so good. I prefer her if they put a little bit more of a long hair just for you guys to have that little throwback to Hachima Hachima na 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 oh, yeah that, that song yeah. for those you don't know that you know you just for you newbies of K-pop good thing about getting to know groups is researching on Wikipedia on Miss K-pop <laughs> you just write the name of the group and you just put Miss K-pop and you'll find a lot of things and you see all the MVs that he done. Jesus, yes, yeah. But anyways, back to this song, uh, this new one. Really, they were wearing suits. I I seen them on the comments. I know usually you we usually kind of ignore. Them. I'm like, nah. Some people are just making an issue about a black guy in the MV. I have no issue. He's just a person. Like seriously. It's nice to have a bit of different, not always a white person, not always Asian, not always Latino. So it's nice to have, oh how can I explain this? I don't, I don't want to be found racist, it's just, I don't want that kind of feel, how, let's say like for example, you're in one country and it has to be that specific race and that specific kind of people. So whereas in America, I know it's more liberal, or here in the UK, it's a little, actually it's more liberal than America. Because when it comes to music, they don't really give a shite whether you're Asian, whether you're black, whether you're Latino, whether you're Spanish, whether you're, you're European, actually European, Spanish is European, so whether, whether you're European, or America, or Australian that makes sense they don't get where you're from it's just or oriental asian because asian and oriental are just very different but still the same thing or african it doesn't matter it doesn't really matter where where it's music is in one place it doesn't really matter where you're from i mean you see like when before Zane, there you have Zane. I mean, Zane is not even one hundred percent English. He's half English, but he's still got Asian in him. Not Asian Oriental, but Asian like Pakistan, which is still Asian. It's Arabic, but it's Asian. It's an Asian country. But with that said, um, I don't want to rant over things like this, but just to understand this. Music is all around the world. Music is music, so love it. If you hate it, just don't need to watch it and just put stupid comments. But back to the MV, I like the colourful of her hair. 
the swimsuits were on point the little the outfits they wore were really on point their shirts was a lot I wish it was a more of an outdoor for the swimsuits but that's just me but with that said it was a good envy but I did wish it was like the swimsuits uh, when they were in the swimsuit the first time I wish it was more in a swimming pool like like to start it last year but I think they played it safe just not to try and copy Sistar and that's how I felt in one way just now probably that or probably in the beach but still again Sistar did that last year too with I swear but it could be somewhere like in the cruise or in a boat but somewhere that is different but not on the box but anyways with that said that's just K-pop probably they're just trying to make it different and quirky but I still love the outfit still love the swimsuit the hair was on point the dance the choreo as always they're always on point I mean why would you hate them like seriously you must be blind but with that said um I have no bias in this group but probably must be Mina I think Mina's my my bias I like her voice she looks like a bit of GD she actually looks like GD actually when she smiles and stuff and she is she's, she's cute and my friend consider her the kind of wife that he would have because he he likes her because she's she has a stubborn face I'm like right yeah he nearly died and I probably might send him this one and he will die again I'm <laughs> I'm just a horrible friend, but that's what friends do. Friends care about about uh, helping how to get a girlfriend, just like from those countries like that, like Korea, Japan, China, Vietnam, Thailand. If there's more Asian countries that don't know that they are into Asian, comment down below. <laughs> and yeah. And that is all you guys. I give this one a 9 out of 10. I mean, I still wish the swimsuits was outdoor. But with that said, it was a good MV, good song. Uh, but yeah, I know they can, the, the directors and the industry can improve a little bit more with the group and make it more ooh, 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 ah, in your face again, probably. Well, with that said, that is all you guys. Um, please remember to subscribe my channel, like this video, share this video. Also, follow me on my social media such as Instagram, Twitter, <laughs> Tumblr and MySpace. And also like my fan page on Facebook. And please remember to, for those who like to be in part of a crew, like filming, directing and editing and that's producing and all that stuff please remember to add me slash follow me on cheney um hive.com and also on linkedin you'll find me as amaging palencia palencia so you'll find me eventually and also for those who love stories like fan fiction non-fan fictions any kind of stories please remember to follow me on Deviant Art, Wattpad, and Asian Fanfics, and I have to remind myself and remind you guys, my beautiful people, on Wattpad and on YouTube for who loves stories, who likes reading stories. Um, please remember to uh, not before I say that. Sorry, take that back. Uh, I'm up for the Watties Award on Wattpad and 2015, so I am part of three stories are up for it so it has a hashtag what is 2015 and with that you just just remember to for add me on on thing you can send me a message and stuff and also with the stories you read there are, or you can read the non that's not really that has less views you can read it as well but the one who has more views like that has that is up for the awards please remember to read my stories vote for my stories and also last of all 
leave a comment on my stories and that is all you guys i love you all and everyone and salam